Hey everyone, we are heading into Aldi's today to see what they have new in my favorite aisle. Um, I go there every couple weeks, but I had to wait for the snow to get cleared this week. So we are heading in here to see what is new. First thing I saw in here is these accent cabinets. I've seen a lot of people hauling these, a lot of people getting like a couple of them and putting them together, making like TV consoles out of them. They're very nice. They say they have a shelf on the inside also. Um, you could pause that there to see the size, but they were $69. Of course, with the glare, you could not even see what it is. These little coffee bars are so cute. These little tiered trays. I mean, you don't even have to use them as a coffee bar. You could just decorate them up like any other tiered tray. They had the metal ones. And they also had the ones with the wood that were really pretty, too. Sorry, I was trying to get up here to get that out, but of course I didn't. And those were $9.99. And they have these canisters. These are so nice. This stoneware, they are very heavy. They are, I of course can't get this one out. Um, I want to show you. It has a little scoop that comes with it. The tops are made out of wood. Um, yeah, these are really nice. They're very like a matte finish, but ugh, so pretty. And it has that little scooper hangs on the side. And then I missed, I didn't even see these as I was going by. So I'm kind of back up here because they have the sugar and they have the flour canisters in there too. And you know, they're different sizes and those are really nice. I couldn't get them out of there because they were up too high for me, but I want to check out these candles that were $4.49 and these are really pretty. You'll have to pause this if you want to see all of the um, ingredients, or not ingredients, the scents, what they're calling them there. Um, I can't remember what that one was, but they all smelled really good. I don't know what kind of a throw they have, but they smelled really nice. I like that one. I love you cherry much. And that one's marriage, you know, cherries, strawberry. Um, they just smell really good. And down there was some rugs and things too that I didn't get down to, but burning romance. And what is that? Lemon, pink pepper, and something else. Like I said, just pause out there if you want to see what they all say. But um, yeah, they smelled really nice. And these little wax melts, these smelled great too. Uh, they had the vanilla one, the um, magnolia blossom, fresh lemon, and then they had the um, white almond, which smelled wonderful. And they were only $1.89. But I didn't pick up any of those because, you know, I don't burn that. Well, I do have a candle burner, though, down in my craft room now that I got for Christmas. These mattress pads are really nice. They're really thick. They're really heavy. They had king. They had queen. They were $24.99. Um, I didn't see any twin anywhere. And these pillows were to die for. Oh, my gosh. They were so soft. It was like hugging a big teddy bear. And then they had these big round ones, almost like footballs. Um, just really nice little accent pillows and what were they? They were $9.99, but really, really nice. And then they had these cute sets for like a kid's bathroom, little waste baskets with the, like the different animals on there. And that was got a cute little bunny there. You could get them for Easter, has the matching toilet brushes and they're really heavy duty too. They're not like real skimpy or anything like that. And then over here they have, to match those sets, these really cute cups. I mean, look how nice these are. These are, they are heavy, they're thick. I mean, you could probably, I don't know, drop them a million times and nothing would happen. Same with these little soap dispensers. They're just really a nice heavy weight and $4.99. Um, can't beat that either. I love this aisle. There's just always something new and cute in this aisle to find. Now, these blankets up here, these were super soft. I love their Sherpa blankets. I got a couple. I actually have one for my dog bed out there, too. I should have got another one. Those were marked down only $14.99 from, like, 20 bucks. But, again, they had the king. They had the queen. They had all these pretty colors. Um, but that's all, like, full queen and king. I didn't see. Well, I guess the full queens are usually this, pretty much the same thing. But, yes, yeah, so, so pretty. So. Yeah, I really don't need another blanket, but they're so nice. I love them. I have a couple on my couch that I use all the time. Sorry, it takes me a little while to get around here. This five-in-one activity set I thought was cute for $19.99 for kids. It's for, it says it's indoor, outdoor, all kinds of little activities in there. And then they had these here. There's these Max 
things and they're like kind of like a lego thing i'm guessing i don't know i'm out of the loop when it comes to the kids toys anymore but i thought those were really cool what a cute thing it looks like an egg you could use that for e sticking a big old easter basket and i guess there are different kinds and different ones different numbers but those are all the same number now these towels i wish i hadn't just got all new towels because i'll tell you what i would have got these they were so nice and so pretty they would have looked so nice in my bathroom but i just bought a whole new set from walmart not too long ago and they also had the matching uh, hand towels and washcloth sets so ugh, yeah kind of sad that i already bought some from walmart because they were so pretty they had the tans and the the green, I would have got the green because that was really nice. Then they had the set of two under the bed storage containers. I love these. I just bought a bunch from uh, Timu and I could have just got them at all these, but same, pretty much the same price. You get a two pack. Um, did I get it the size of this one? Let's see. Uh, there it is. There's all your dimensions there. Again, I know some people say I go too fast, enough, but just pause if you want to see the things. They had these comforter sets, too, that I thought were really nice. Um, not exactly my style of thing, but again, they had the king, they had the queen um, in these two different patterns here. But yeah, they're really nice, nice, heavy, not real heavy, because I don't like real, real heavy weight things. And there's my fingers again, no matter how hard I try. I always get my fingers in the picture. But look at those pillows here. These are for pets. And how cute is that if you have a, like a little dog or something that likes to snuggle up underneath something or a cat, whatever, either or. I mean, they're not a big, big size, but oh, they were so nice and fluffy and soft. Had all these pretty colors and they were $19.99. But yeah, they're so pretty. And they also had these little metallic Puffer jackets for dogs. I thought that was so cute. There's my husband down there waiting patiently for me because he knows once I get in this aisle, it'll be a little bit. <laughs> and then they had these cat teaser toys for $2.99. I thought that was a pretty good price for those. Those are cute little birdies. Now down here, they had some more of the uh, planners. Now those aren't, that's not the price of the planners. That's supposed to be kitchen calendars and something yeah 12 month wall calendars I see one underneath there but um let's see see there's I think they're marked down to 6.99 and I, I paid eight something I believe when I got mine but they're really nice and they have some really cute prints um you know you can decorate these up do whatever you want to they got places in here for a little bit of journaling if you need to write you know a bunch of notes and things down and I live buy my calendars because you know there's always appointments and everything else and there was a bunch of other stuff i didn't get to up there but these are the telescoping um things to scrape your brooms and stuff for scrape your windshield those were real nice if you got like an suv and then on here they have that's a charging station and oh these down here these are great especially this time of year these are the covers for your windshields they had these in a bunch of different sizes you know you hook them on there and what a blessing that is when you got one especially when it's icy oh there's nothing worse than trying to go out in the morning and get the ice they were 9.99 and they had this nice little shoe rack over here too they only had one of those left a four-tier shoe rack for 12.99 and then, of course, this another thing this time of year, when you're done shoveling off your car, there you go. Carabba heating pad. I'll tell you, that's a must-have in, I think, anybody's house. And that was, what was that? $14.99. But, yeah, there's my fingers again. Stupid fingers. Oh, and these puzzles. They had all these cute little DC puzzles. Um, and then I saw flannel sheet sets. You know, I'm all over the place. I get so excited in this aisle. <laughs> <laughs> but my husband did pick out one of those puzzles i'll show you here in a second here's a nice little bath mat you won't slip on that little booger um there it is he got the one with the balloons he's a happy guy he loves doing puzzles in the winter time it's kind of a thing to do um oh these boots i thought these boots were so cute and i'm like oh they're for kids i would wear those boots 
I thought they were so pretty. But those were, they were nice. They were $6.49, which I thought was pretty good. And then they found some really nicer boots down here for us adults here. Um, for four, or $24.99, I believe these were. You know, everything wasn't in the exact spot it should be. You know, it happens when, especially the boots and stuff, people really dig through them. These were really pretty, too. So, but they only had a couple pairs of those. And, of course, my big old feet, they always go first, the big sizes, it seems like. And they had some, you know, like, little stretchy pants and a little heater. But these baskets caught my eye, so I had to rush down here and look at those. $12.99, and you get a set of two. And these are quite pricey. I looked at these, like, on Wayfair and stuff to put under my one table. And, um, yeah, I didn't get them. But this I thought was cool. You have a boot, shoe, and glove dryer. Um, and then that was what, $14.99. And then they had a really nice, um, they had the shower curtains. They had just all kinds of stuff in this aisle. There's just everything. And this, of course, I skip over that, right? But these are great for in your craft room and stuff. I didn't get them because I really didn't care for the blue color, but you know, if you got like the blue, um, but you know, not just for tools and screws and stuff. And there's a nice rug pad. Um, they didn't have any of those. They had those really nice washable rugs there for a while at all these, but those were, they were all gone, of course. But those little mats would be perfect to put underneath there. Now these, I love these. These are a, what are they calling those? Pottery mugs. Warming pottery, warming pottery mugs. But I thought these were just so unique. There's a thing there to put your little spoon, but look at the handle. Isn't that just so different? I love that. And they had them in all these pretty colors. And it's that nice, like, matte-looking finish. But, you know, it wasn't rough. They were very, you know, nice and smooth. $4.99. I thought those were pretty cool. But, of course, I just bought... There's that finger again. Get out of there. Um, I just bought a bunch of the soup bowls for, like, chili and stuff at Dollar Tree. Then they had these nice bathroom sets here with the cup and the soap dish and soap dispenser for $9.99. Some of this stuff would be great to pick up as gifts, too, to put away for Christmas. Now, this was different. It's got a, um angled drawer organizer. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that before. And that's all made out of, like, the bamboo. Oh, that's little pea squeaking in the background. Sorry. I had to bring him in here with me because he was just being so loud. Weren't you, little pea? And then we headed over to the Valentine goodies section here. I just went through this real quick here just to show you some of the goodies they have. Um, and then let's see, where are we going here? They got all the cute little hearts and all the little candies and the Reese's hearts. They look good. And then they had this um, red velvet cookie bark. That looked yummy, too. I didn't get too much in here. Um, I mainly came to Aldi's to get fruits and vegetables and stuff for my birds. These, I did pick up a box of these. And let me tell you what, these were so good. They're three forty eight dollars for the little heart-shaped ding-dongs. And, I mean, I get the round ones every once in a while, but they don't taste the same as they used to. But those were really, really good. And then you have the Cupid's Crunch here. And my main exciting thing that I came to see if they had in this aisle, because I've seen other people hauling it, was this Cupid Brew Coffee Collection. This has so many nice coffees in there. I got the Advent calendar at Christmas time where I had the 24 um, different coffees in there. And I'll tell you what, they were all really, really good. So we're going to try out this one. There's raspberries, vanilla beans, there's cherry. They're just so yummy. And then they have the Russell Stover's hearts and, you know, all kinds of just yummy, yummy stuff. Rice Krispie treats. And, oh, these. I should have got those. I didn't pick those up. And when I go back, I'm hoping they still have some of those Cheerios with the strawberry and the chocolate. And then down here, I found some really nice rugs. They have these nice rainbow rugs. These are great to get the snow off of your boots and stuff when you come in the house. Um, and then they had a bunch of these other ones. I did not pick them all up because they were so heavy. Um, that was Home Sweet Home, just to give you an idea. And they were, what, $6.99. I don't think that's bad at all. But they had a bunch of different patterns, but they were real heavy 
um, like rubber matting on the back. So I didn't pick them up. Then they had these reversible block signs that were really pretty. Um, it's just one big block, but it has, you know, the stuff on both sides for Valentine's Day. They had some really pretty tablecloths here. Um, they're all vinyl. So, you know, they're easy to clean up or whatever. And those were only $2.99. And then like these nice little oven mitts. I thought those were real pretty. I don't know if I got the price of those. Let's see if I do. I don't remember now. But I'm sure they were only a couple dollars. Uh, that one I thought was nice too with the coffee. I don't know why my camera all of a sudden wanted to turn sideways. But thank goodness it waited until the end to do that. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so many pretty different pretty uh, patterns on these. You go somebody happily shopping. Yeah, I didn't care too much for just that zigzaggy pattern, but most of them were really nice. But anyway, thanks guys for coming shopping with me. Um, I hope you saw some good stuff, and I will see you guys all next time. Have a great day, everyone.